hi everyone welcome back to my channel my name is siri and this is everything siri so i'm gonna be going we're gonna get right into it so i'm gonna do this hair review on me brazilian um so i'm this i'm wearing the hair right now and this is the brazilian make hair actually let me pull it up because i don't want to speak incorrectly and i want to make sure that i have all of the facts in front of me okay so this is their mink brazilian body wave hair i like my hair to be very full okay so before i get into that i learned about this hair read from cash doll i follow cash doll on instagram sis this is it um i follow her on instagram and she's always posting about this hair and let's be real her hair is always late so i was like you know what i deserve to look slay even if i'm going to shop right like <laughs> so i went ahead and purchased the hair um i got so i like my hair really full so even though i knew i had envisioned that i wanted this hair to be straight from like a, a I want to keep this hair straight because I just like I love how this hair looks so I already had it in my head so I know that I like thick hair um, full hair for my wigs because one I have a big head so I feel like the fuller the hair is like it kind of camouflages just how big my head is maybe it's in my head but whatever but then I also like to have full hair so if I want to pull my hair to the front I'm not left with just like a little sliver of hair in the back and then i'm ended up looking real crazy like i don't like that that's just my preference some people like thinner hair because they feel like um not thinner hair but less bundles because it'll, it'll look a little bit more natural and i get that but i like when my hair is full so i ended up getting five bundles and a closure and they're all body wave um the what is it brazilian yes the mink brazilian body wave um so my the inches i got were 226s 224s a 22 and that's it and then for the closure i got a 20 inch closure so when i received the hair it came sealed up okay i when i picked that thing up from the from the um what is it called when I picked it up from the post office, you know, I'm the type of person where I want to open up my packages. It was sealed up. So I really appreciated that because, you know, let's be real. This hair is not cheap. I mean, it's affordable. Yes. But like you want to feel secure. Like, oh, my package was like taken care of. Sorry, you're going to see me comb my hair because I just washed my hair. So it's very like, you know, my hair is like super fresh and it just moves. It does whatever it wants. That's what it's doing right now. But I don't got no problem with that. Okay. Because when that wind hit and it's flowing different, look at that. Oh, excuse my bed, but look at that. Ah, okay, let me get to this. And I'm going to give my honest opinion, honestly, truly. Because your girl ordered this hair on her own off the strength of her. So it ain't like somebody made me do this. I got five bundles and a closure. I used every piece of my... Um, I used every, yeah, I used all of the bundles. I didn't leave a piece out. And you know what's so crazy? I still wanted more hair. I know it sounds crazy and a lot, but when I tell you this hair is so bomb. I got the 26 inches, and I feel like, honestly, it's much longer than 26 inches because I've had 26 inches in my life prior to from other companies, and it did not fall where this falls, but there's no complaints from me because... I love my hair i love the inches i love the inches just know it's like it's at my hip and i'm five seven and like i said i use every bundle and my longest one in the back is 26 but i did put the 28 up at the top but like i said it ended up it ended up being the same length as the 26 because of where i put the 28 if that makes sense like the 28 is up here and i did that on purpose because i didn't want to I did that on purpose because I didn't want to put the shorter length in up at the top and then the top up here was much fuller than everything else like I wanted everything to kind of be like and everything to kind of you know I wanted everything to be even out um but when I got the hair it did come with did I lose it 
So with the hair came um, like a satin head tie. Oh, just to give you a closer look, this is, it has their, their name on it, Make Brazil. Which this helps a lot because when I, because my wig is glueless, I use, um, I use mousse, the foam, to lay my, ba my baby hairs on my closure. And then I just use this with like the wax paper. Um, I definitely don't have no wax paper to show you. Oh, it's bundled up. But I use this first. And then I use this to tie it up. And then I'll do my makeup. And then once I take it off, my baby hairs are, you know, they chilling. They there. They there. Um, what I will say, along with everything else that I've said, this closure okay so i i big chop around i big chop last year in may so i've been playing around with closures and wigs like i make my own wigs but i've been playing around closures and frontals i've been playing around with them and it's a lot of work but when i say this closure was so easy to handle and although i have a little bit of history with it i didn't feel as overwhelmed as some other closures that i've dealt with in the past so this closure did come pre-plucked um which was perfect but i went ahead and plucked pre -pl uh, pre -pl i went ahead and plucked some more just because um i wanted a little i just it's just my preference like i just wanted it a little bit more um thinned out in the front um but the when i bleached the knots first of all that bleach took so easily i've had closures in the past where the knots are so thick that i've had to like try and bleach the knots um, more than once and that's always a pain so if some if you're someone who is kind of new to closures and wigs and all of that i would definitely recommend getting their closures um i don't know too much about the frontals obviously because i've never gotten a frontal from them but i would like to assume that it's the same thing but i would just say in general for anyone who's new with um you know lace i would say start off with a closure this closure is so amazing um the closure doesn't have filler hair so what that means is like some vendors will put like shorter hairs um in like mixed in with the hair to make to give the appearance that it's full so what happened ends up happening is that up here is super super thick and then once it gets down to the ends of the closure it's super thin and it's it's the most annoying thing because it's hard to blend especially when you wash it and then like the hairs are stick it's it's a lot so what i will say is this mink brazilian honey they know what they're doing so i know my makeup is that well if you didn't watch my other video go ahead and watch that because i did a makeup tutorial on this look okay so yeah go over to my last video and watch that after this one and then you can also like comment and subscribe if you like or just comment and sub i mean like and subscribe at this point i'm still new in the game so i don't really know if any of that matters yet but i mean love is love whatever but when i was doing my makeup for this tutorial my hair was just air dried um i didn't do anything to it all i did was lay the baby hairs you know with the foam and things like that and then um just kind of flatten out any flyaways at the top um now for my flyaways i use erica j her frizz bully wax stick so i just run that up there because you know it's a little flyaways but that's fine um and i just did that and then i just you know press my hair out so when I so to straighten this hair I just use I don't like to use a lot of product in it so when I'm straightening this hair I don't when I straighten my hair I don't want to use a lot of product so all I did was use um, like a Tresemme heat protectant and then I split my hair into two and then I used the Chi Keratin Silk Infusion I got this at Marshall's a while ago for like $15 and you don't need a lot of it I use like a because I have so much hair in my um I have so much hair on this unit fancy unit so because i have so much hair on this unit i used about like a quarter size rather than a dime size that everybody mentions and i just run that through focusing on the ends um you know and then like i'll go up at the top and flatten it out and honestly this hair got super straight super fast um what else about this hair shedding okay so i did end excuse me i did end up cutting my webs because you know i had to like fix i had to readjust how i put them <sighs> yeah it was a lot but i did cut my wefts and i usually don't but not all of my wefts are cut i think towards the top more so because i had to readjust our cut um so i did cut the wefts how many times do you guys say that <laughs> 
um i did cut my webs and again and there's not a lot of shedding when i comb through it mind you i have five and a half bundles now and when i comb through it i have bundles and a closure that sounds crazy doesn't it but you see like when i comb it and like i flip this hair over i have so much hair and it's not like it doesn't feel super heavy and it just looks so full like that's what i'm looking for when like my hair like is on one side but look i still got all of this over here that's what i like like oh the ends oh my goodness the ends are amazing when i tell you the ends are amazing the hair honestly okay so before this i ordered some hair right I'm not gonna tell you who the person is um because i just that's distasteful like if i was doing a review on their hair i would keep it real but i don't want to pin the two together so the other company the hair was i got the same i got the same length um a 26 inch and it was long and it was beautiful but the ends were so thin and raggedy and I was so sad because like <sighs> this person just came so accredited and just like it was just so many good reviews that no one kept it real which I be trying to say if you keep it real then like you don't waste people's time and you can get people's trust like that's the big thing I get it marketing whatever whatever but be truthful but anyway that company hair was so thin but look at this look at these it's full all the way down to the end and it didn't have any split ends i didn't touch my ends i didn't do anything to my ends this is how it came um i am a thousand percent a fan i wash my wig um once a week um i do make sure that i deep condition my wig every time i wash it because i do put a lot of heat because i wear it straight so and i told you i'm a little crazy so i'll be like straightening it and straightening it a lot and i just don't want to damage his hair because i love this hair so much as it stands i've had this hair now i want to say going on three weeks almost a month and um i have no complaints like the hair doesn't tangle there's no shedding when i first received the hair um first of all i knew this hair was gonna be lit just off when i opened up the packaging like that the luster on this hair is crazy like even when i just wash it and let it air dry like this just has a chi infusion in it but like do you see this i don't put that much chi in it because you know that's on a 15 dollars so you know this is just natural luster 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 look at that like this hair is so oh, amazing like amazing like and I get it, hair is expensive. That's why I made this hair into a wig, a glueless wig at that, so I can um, tend to it how I need to. I take this hair off at night. I take this hair off every night. Um, sometimes I do guys to be glue the front, but I don't, um, I just take like the rat tail comb and because it's a closure, I just go right underneath it and just lift it up and then I just take the wig off and like hang it up or lay it flat somewhere. But yeah, like, <laughs> I feel like I said a mouthful, but let, let me tell y'all, this hair is so bomb. Like, so bomb. Look at this. I can't make this up. Like, are you crazy? Like, are you, are you, are you dumb? In Remy Ma's voice, are you dumb? Like, <laughs> no, this hair is, I'm a fan. I'm gonna probably come back again, like, when I've had the hair a little bit longer and it's kind of, like, aged to see if anything changes but like i said no shedding there was no smell when i got it no tangles i know when i do comb my hair i do get a couple of strands but let's be real i have five and a half bundles in my head and i cut my webs and i don't i didn't seal my webs nothing like that but even like couples like one or two i want to talk about a couple strands i'm probably talking like maybe like three or four like hold on let me comb this side and so y'all could see because i haven't touched this side okay hold on well, let me get some hair over here and I'm using a rat tail comb start from the bottom let's not be barbaric starting from the bottom working my way up Ooh. I'm infamous for combing my webs <laughs> like girl calm down it is not on your scope Dang, that hurt. 
Like, look. Look at this. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Oh! Ugh. Love it. Okay. And look. I ain't even clean my comb. And there's no hair on my lap. Oh my goodness. No hair on my lap and there's nothing in my comb. I hate when people do this. But look, it's literally no hair in my comb. None. Zero. So this hair right now got me on cloud nine. And there was a company that I love. Like, love, 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 love. And I was so, so stuck on. But I was just like, you know what? Let me try something new. And like I said, I've been eyeing it. Because Cash, I'll be wearing it. And I'll be seeing her hair. And I've been eyeing it. Actually, my best friend put me on. Hey, bestie. She put me on to the hair. And like, I, I was having my, I had my eye on it for a while now. And I was like, you know what? I need some hair. I need a new wig. Like I said, I have a big chop last year. So all I've been doing are like braids and wigs. And, um... Your girl, your girl is out here. Like, this is like, I'm so happy with this purchase because I know this hair is going to last me. I'm going to make sure this hair lasts me, but I know this hair is going to last me because you don't have to do much at all. Like, this hair, I can't, I can't say nothing else, honestly. I'm trying to think of anything else. Um, yeah, I don't know what else I can honestly say. I hope I'm not missing anything. Shedding. Oh, curls. So I did curl this hair. I curled it with a wand, and it came out really nice. Like it came out like some waves, um, because I used a tiny wand, and those curls lasted me for a good like three days. And then after that, I had washed my wig. So I don't know. It could have possibly lasted longer. It could have possibly lasted longer, but I don't know because I washed my wig and it held those curls. Um, um, so I guess at this point I'm just gonna come back with maybe like a one and a half or two month review and just check in. I'm gonna be completely honest and I'm gonna let you know the real on it because again, ain't no point in lying. Dang, you can see my bed. <laughs> it's no point in lying or trying to come up in here in front for y'all because let me tell you, that's not cute. We don't, uh -uh. we don't do that over here. <laughs> um what else am I trying to think I could even say or do um I talked about this right honestly no complaints no complaints hold on let me just show you don't mind my hair flying I have my fan on it Look at this. Look at these ends. Look at that close up of these ends. No split ends. Do you hear me? Not none. So I feel like I feel like I feel like I'm missing something. I feel like I didn't mention something. Um, but if you have any questions, you can definitely comment, ask me any questions about the hair. Um, I will leave a link to the hair. And I will also leave the lengths of my wig and all of that below if you want to achieve the same look, if whatever, whatever the case may be. Um, but can't leave without saying, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, or let's work on subscribing. We're going to work on subscribing, but if you want to like it and comment, who am I to stop you? Okay. But thank you for watching, and we're going to link in my next video.